Dinner for tonight. Chicken and salad. Chicken salad. Welcome to Wednesday. It's Wednesday. I forgot to change my glasses out. Oh well. Well, everyone, after a great dinner, uh, I have some good news. I actually was able to get my monitors. I has new monitors now. They were really good. They were on sale. They were like 100 bucks or something or less than 100 bucks per monitor. These are 23 well, it says 21.5 inches, but they're really 22 inches big, not 23. Where did I get 23 from? I don't know. Anyways, well, they're going to be installed, and they're supposed to replace those two guys that are just small and dinky and blech, no more. No more of that. More widescreen stuff. So I'm going to do that right now, and I'll be right back. Okay, after about 15 minutes, we've got this. It's so pretty. So nice. Now to turn them on without actually bumping them around. So let's power, power. <clears throat> Energy Star, yay. These are connected via DVI on my computer, so. <gasps> They're, oh, wait, are they backwards? Or are they backwards? Let's just fix that now. Okay. And that's. I'm lazy, I'll just make this then main display there we go perfect now I've got all my stuff big monitors this is excellent now I can do all kinds of work and finally have widescreen instead of just this compressed screen which is driving me nuts so and also it should help out with LP stuff and when I boot into the Mac partition I'd be able to um, <clears throat> to edit stuff on the for the vlog so that's gonna do for now as far as just uh, what I'm doing for this because I've got some other plans. I got to go do some errands and I'll be right back. It's nothing major, just some groceries and things like that. So I should be back pretty soon. Well, where does the time go? I've finally finished uploading everything. I'm just loving these new monitors, they're so awesome. And I got my TV up and then I'm just playing some TV while I work on editing and computers and whatnot. Today was a monitor day, so I, I liked it. I, I might just buy a few more if they're if they're any good. Um, I did notice that they were DVI-D. I believe the dash D ones, you can buy a converter that convert HDMI connections into it as well. But I have them connected via DVI, so they're higher quality. Anyways, I'm, I'm heading to bed. That's enough for today. It's already 11.30, so let's meet back same time, same place tomorrow, shall we? Well, hello everyone. Welcome to Thursday. It's Thursday, and it's almost Friday. Is that what that means? And I, it's my turn to cook, so I'm going to be cooking something with tilapia. Oh, pardon me. Today is also the release date for Super Smash Brothers uh, for the 3DS, and me or Austin and I, what I should say, are planning to go and pick up our copies today at GameStop. Sorry for all the rustling. That's just because I'm getting stuff out of the fridge. Let's chop up with the something I'm gonna make for the fish. Anyways, we're gonna go to GameStop today after. I don't know, we'll probably leave around seven, eight ish. I want to get through with the Let's Play though for the day. That way, I don't have to worry about it. As, uh, we're going there as far as editing goes. So that's, uh, that's gonna have to happen pretty fast. I need to cook and then get everything ready and then edit and do it all within like three hours or less which is it's gonna be tough but I'll, I'll manage okay so I got all the vegetables cut up and I also got the fish first layer of fish I'm gonna put some vegetables on top of that another layer of fish more vegetables and in the oven it goes actually that does look rather appetizing there's lots of onions and garlic and red and blue, red and green bell pepper and that's it so yeah it's gonna go in the oven for 30 minutes at 400 and then I'll make some rice on the side. So half an hour later you get that. It looks beautiful and colorful and delicious and get to my belly. I'm hungry. It's probably been in the vlogs before. Yeah it has but this time it looks a lot more fancier. I actually cut up all the vegetables finer this time instead of having them in chunks. Is the video in HD now? In HD. It's 3D. Ooh. No, not really. You um, eat and then record and then edit, upload and then leave for uh, Smash Brothers 3DS. So I didn't have to waste uh, another a lost street pass, basically. Mm -hmm. Let me see here. Uh, did it upload? Yep. 
Okay. Well, that's done uploading, and we're off to do Smash Brothers, right? You're doing Smash Brothers. I'm doing Smash Brothers. Jeff is going to be there for street passing, so we're off to GameStop for midnight release. We're here. So, wait, this character, this character Only a few hours early. Yay. Oh, and you feel it? You got me. Whoops. Uh, yeah. 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 Oh, it's not that. Uh, we're going to get free swag from our rep. Cool. They always move at like 30 frames a second. Like, that was like a Free swag. What kind of free swag are we going to get? I don't know. Handing out free swag. This was. Yes. Yes. Of course, free swag. What kind of free swag? What is this? Oh, four of you settle it and smash. Who's no. Win? Done. I'm up. Let's do it. Well, actually, it's only three of us playing. Unless you want to hop in and get I in can. on this. I you can't. Can. I will fight you for one. Uh, what else we got? Uh oh. What? What did you hand him that was for Bravely Default? That was, a, that was an AR ah. card? So next time oh. you're in internet access, you'll be able to play with them. <laughs> Free Super Smash Brothers for Nintendo 3DS download demo. You've already got that. I've already got that. I got it a week before it came out. Why aren't you playing it then? On your system and play it. Yeah. I've already got it on my system. Yeah, play it. it. That's what we're saying. Play the game. No, I'm doing Street Pass crap. That's more important. Make up your mind. Street Pass or... I can figure a few of them. You should, you should have stopped. You should have stopped at Do you have friends? Do you have friends? Yes, actually. All right, let me get my Thank you. thing out. Oh, hey, we're fighting. That's pretty cool. That comes out the 21 November. Getting our stuff. I finally got it. Well, everyone, I'm back home, and it's time for bed. Because, but I am very excited to see that. Oh, that I've got this game. It's gonna be lots of lots of fun. I haven't opened it yet, but I'll open it tomorrow. The Nintendo rep was there. She gave us some free swag, some free demo code cards, or whatever. And she also gave us this lanyard, which was cool, you know, um, of Mario Kart 8 lanyard swag stuff. So, yeah, it was pretty cool. So, anyways, I'm going to bed. I'm tired. So let's be back same time, same place tomorrow, shall we? Well, hello, everyone. Welcome to today's Friday. It's finally Friday. <sighs> but the problem is it's 1051 at night. Uh, you're probably saying, well, why did you wait until now to actually start a vlog? Well, it's really simple. I had tons of things to do at work, and <clears throat> also I had to, well, I I ordered Judy and Kathy both a, because uh, they don't like using their credit cards online, a uh, those little fitness wristband things, because I got them on a deal for like 60 bucks each. So I ordered them both one, and they paid me back for it. So I went to go to their phones and set it up. That happened at about 6.30. That ended up rolling till about 7. Then they invited me out to lunch or dinner, <clears throat> and that ended up going on till 9. And then Kathy thought it would be a good idea if we went out to go get ice cream, all of us. So then we went to get ice cream. And I know I should have probably brought my camera with me, but I didn't bring my camera with me because this is dinner, and that's it. I mean, nothing really special. I had a chicken fettuccine alfredo, and that's it. And I've been having a lot of calorie-intensive meals for this past week, but I need to go burn them off. But that's why it's 10.52 right now, because I just got back, and that's it. I mean, what, what more could you want to do? I mean, I just, I don't know what else you'd want to do. So, anyways, um, it's 10.52 right now, and I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to record an a episode and upload it tonight. <laughs> I just hope. But I have the stamina to do it, um, but because, like I said, I try to ah, I try to upload one video a day. If not, I'll upload two the next day, or try to do something similar along those lines. Um, you know, because the channel's growing. But something that I forgot to mention yesterday, when I got my copy of um, Brawl, was that I was talking to the manager at the GameStop. Because he and I, sorry, uh, dropped something. He and I know each other quite well, and 
uh, he is looking for people that he can, he can basically trust uh, to help out with like the store and things like that as far as you know when they have premieres or launches to just ha have an extra set of eyes you know for everything which I mean I'd be more than willing to do it's not a big deal as long as I get my copy of my game eventually I don't have to be the first one to play it I don't really as long as I get a copy you know and he appreciates you know people doing that so what I'll do I, I gave him my phone number and he gave me his information on you know the back of this card and I'm gonna volunteer for stuff so yeah, volunteering is good. Uh, the next event should be the Pokemon Omega uh, event, which will probably have. Um, I was pitching some ideas to him that he kind of liked because I have, I have projectors here <clears throat> in my studio, and I don't use them. Like I have them set up for my TV whenever I want to watch a nice movie or something. But other than that, I don't really use them at all or hardly at all. So I was thinking, well, we can bring one of those out, bring out a Wii U, play some Mario Kart or something, and be fun with it. And I don't know if I mentioned this, but I, I got a lanyard from the rep yesterday. I probably mentioned it, but I don't know if I actually showed it off. It's a Mario Kart lanyard. It's kind of cool. It even has some Mario Kart little trivia things for the Wii U memorabilia. I'll probably just put this up next to the other lanyards I have uh, next to the room, or next to my room. So, yeah. But uh, I, I appreciated this, so... Anyways, that's that's what's been happening, and it's it's late. I don't even think I'm gonna even bother you guys with rec the recording because like it's gonna happen. Either it will or it will not. I'll let you know tomorrow. But tomorrow's gonna be a little crazy because Andrew and I informally made a plan to go to the DMV tomorrow and go get our scooters registered because apparently the guy that sold it to us lied about registration. You do need to have a plate for it. We didn't know that. Andrew got stopped, and the cop told him this. So we got to go get plates now. Now that we, I, I haven't been warned yet. I, I can still get away with it, but we have to go get plates now. So we're gonna try to make that a thing for tomorrow, if possible. Um, I'm gonna try to clean up my room because my room is a mess again. It's always a mess. It just progressively gets worse as, as I, you know, make it dish out and do laundry. That, that's my biggest plan for tomorrow. But something that I was thinking about also, just because I'm getting all this out of the air, is the vlog. The vlog has been dead in the water, honestly. Uh, if you're actually following along and I actually upload these videos, you'll know that from this moment forward, um, I've been kind of coming up with ideas as far as, because I'm four months behind on the vlog, and that's terrible. I mean, I, I try to sit down and focus on the vlog, and it's a lot harder than you think. It really is. you got to, like, motivate yourself. You have to want to do it, either that or make it kind of like your job. And I don't know how some of these vloggers do it. Like, they do it every day. and But it's their job, you know? I mean, I have... Look, when I say the word real job, I mean that I have a job that society sees as a normal job. YouTube is a real job, but... It's a, it's a job that society doesn't see as a real job. So I have a real, let me go back to this sentence now. I have a real job. I, I work for a company and I'm a computer manager there. I want to someday maybe make YouTube my job. I would love to do that, but I don't have enough support yet for that. I mean, here's hoping maybe one day, I don't know, maybe I'll get internet famous for all I know. I, I, I doubt it. But, I mean, people like to hear a bunch of people scream online, especially when you have high-quality equipment and are willing to sink a bunch of money into a budget like this. This little project, that was 500 bucks easily. Anyways, um, but I, ha I can do stuff like that. The catch, though, is I can't produce as fast as some of these other guys. It's kind of like, like a, having a startup business. It seems like a good idea, but you have to somehow find this much amount of money to start it up. For people that are business majors, they'd, get, they'd understand that. But if you're not, it's it's a really easy concept to understand. You can either, you know, progressively pay it off, but you're going to pay more in the long run, or you can just put it all together, one giant chunk, and it'd be cheaper, and it's all up front. So, anyways, I digress. My original intention was, to, was thinking about this earlier in the week, which was, what if I start uploading vlogs from today or tomorrow or Monday, from Monday forward, once per night, I, I'll make it an objective. One vlog per night 
which is you know that that day, and then upload and it's done. But in the meantime, I will also be working on the past vlogs that are four months old and bringing it up to date. So like I'll be starting here and going this way, but at the same time, I'm also bringing going back and bringing these forward while still moving forward. And then eventually, my goal is to have this go up to the start the starting point that I started. And I'm already in this routine of going forward with the one. So that's the idea. I don't know whether I want to do it or not because I kind of feel like it should be in a sequential order. Because, I mean, it's, it's, that's what I believe that it should be. But otherwise, it'd be like, oh, that's his old news. I don't want to watch that. I want to watch new stuff. You know, it's kind of like watching a new TV show. But then again, you haven't seen it yet. So I don't know. I don't know. It's just one of those things that I was just thinking about. And I need to light a candle because. I just, I like candles, and I like to have my room smelling nice somewhat. Anyways, um, and I like to have the candle on whenever I play Outlast because it makes it a nice little weird asylum, asylum lunatic type of atmosphere, but only one light source, which is my candle. Anyways, um, so that was the idea. That was the thought, and I don't know if I'm going to do it or not. I really think I should. But I'm, I'm balancing it out. And then that brings back the tech channel. The tech channel has been dead in the water too. I have no idea what I'm going to do with it. I want to do stuff. Tr trust me. I really want to do stuff. The problem is when I started the tech channel, it was... Uh, I'm going to put this. My original concept was if I can make this complex tutorial and make it easy for someone to understand. If I can give it to my dad and say, follow this and he can do it from point A to point Z, then I knew it was perfect for anyone to use. That was basically my ultimate test. Now, I don't have any more ideas. I'm out of ideas. I, that's why I haven't done anything new or any kind of really unboxing. I mean, the last thing I did was an unboxing for the, the was it the iRobot, and I, I need to post a review about it, and I have never did that because I never really had the time to do it afterwards because I didn't think anyone really cared. Um, so I need an idea, or I need ideas for what you want the next how-to to be. It has to be something realistic. It has to be something that, you know, people can really are having this issue. I mean, if you're going to tell me, oh, well, the, you know, your Wii tutorial didn't work or, you know, blah, 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 or I want to see, you know, can we back up uh, the games for a GameCube? I'm like, you can Google that and find it, you know? I mean, I could probably write a tutorial on it, but it's, it's, just, it's just like one more step. That's it. I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I'm probably just rambling too much right now. But, like I said, it was it's an idea, and I'm going to try to roll with it for now. I, I might end up doing that. At least I, I'm thinking about it. I just, I don't know. And now I look at the clock. It's 11 o'clock now, and it's... I think I might just go to bed and forget the whole recording. Because no one, nobody's home right now, which would be perfect, because I can yell at my microphone and no one would freak out. But I just, I just feel tired and frustrated now, and I don't know. Anyways, I'm just going to end things off for tonight here. I'm sorry if I rambled so long, but I just some things I had to get off my chest. So let's meet back same time, same place tomorrow, shall we? Hello, everyone. Welcome to Saturday. It's Saturday, and I'm at Walmart with Jeff, and he's so showing no. 12 cents a, a thing. Yeah, that's too All right. Well, we're at Walmart getting candy because it's cheaper to get candy before Halloween than it is closer to Halloween. And it's funny because I only came here to buy this. I bought, I came here to buy some toothbrushes, and we're also looking at candy. So that's that's uh, not a good comment. We're not eating it. Yeah, we're not eating it, but not until after Halloween. That's when it. Yeah, whatever. Anyways, we're looking at candy, all the prices, and hopefully be able to get some kind of formula down. Hopefully. Saturday's just been so weird. They have all kinds of piggy banks here. It's so cool. They have sponge pig. They've got the ninja pigs. They've got football pigs, university pigs. Hey, Jeff, they got Pikachu. Yeah, right there. He's right there. He's hiding in the distance. Are you kidding me? Yeah, right there. See him? There's Pikachu. I thought it was a Pikachu pig. No, not Pikachu pig. Uh, that would be awesome, but they have regular Pikachu. Hey, for 10 bucks? Um, Thinking about getting him? You should get him. If you get him, I'll get the other one. 
you'll get the My Little Pony. Yes. So what you're saying is, I definitely shouldn't get it because I shouldn't actually trying to help you with your, your addiction. It's not an addiction, it's a, it's a hobby. They have a Pinkie Pie My Little Pony bank, along with Darth Pig and Super Pig. But they don't have Spider Pig. Wait, Where's Spider Pig? That's not Darth Pig, that's just... It's Darth Vader? Okay, Darth Vader head. They should definitely have Spider Pig. I don't understand why they don't have Spider Pig. Oh, they do! Bumblebee Pig. Wait, wait, is that Duck Dynasty Pig? That's Duck Dynasty Pig. Uh, no, it's not. Okay. Still. It's kinda, that's really cool. Though. Like this. Yeah, he would. So we're back home and we got, we went to Ace Hardware. We bought a bunch of these random root beer kind of drinks. I'll go over what I got, but Jeff, what did you get? You got butterscotch? Butterscotch beer. Butterscotch beer and drinking it out of what looks like a scotch glass already. How's it taste? Or it smell? Because, you know, that's how you do with good scotch. You gotta, you gotta, mm, it actually does smell really good. Like a cream soda-ish. Stronger than a creamy soda. It needs to be cold, though. That'd make it's it fine. really good. So, how does it taste, Jeff? It's alright. It's pretty strong, though. Pretty strong? Yeah. So, it's just got a strong butterscotch sense to it. Yeah. Hmm. So, it'd be more like a dessert kind of drink. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Well,. This is, what is it called? The Flying Cauldron Butterscotch Beer? Mm. Yeah, non-alcoholic. So, yeah. Well, anyways, while he's doing that, I'm going to go over what I got because I got a few things too. I got the classic A&W one there. We got some root Anchor Ginger Root Beer, which I hear was very good according to the clerk. We've got the Cock and Bowl Ginger Beer again. We've got Bulldogs root beer there, um, <clears throat> brownie caramel cream root beer, and we've got salted caramel root beer from CO Beverage Company, Citra, whatever. Anyway, that's what I got. We're going to try that. What else are you, are you getting, trying now? Well, because they all fell, I have to actually drink them now. Well, this, yeah, that's the one I got. So how does that one taste or smell or whatever? I really don't like it. Is it the caramel flavor? Yeah. All right, well, we'll do something with it. Well, I basically just sat down and started playing my game of uh, Outlast, and then I, before I looked, I looked at the clock, it was already midnight. Um, because apparently, again, I've had having this problem lately where I forget to hit record, or I will hit record on my computer, but it won't record the, the video for some reason. So I just got tired, and I started looking for a new piece of software, and I found one, a good one that actually works. So... I don't know, I'm just, I'm just tired, I've always having to do double the work for one thing I can do one time, and just, it's hard to record a Let's Play with a basically made up of jump scares, and already see it coming, and it's like much, you don't much faster, and things like that, well, I gotta get ready for bed, because it's, it's late, and I'm tired, and my room is slowly, yet surely coming along, as far as getting cleaner, um, I got all my clothes put away, which is good, laundry's all done, just have to focus on finishing everything up and then be done with it. But speaking of being done with everything, let's be back same time, same place tomorrow, shall we? Hello everyone, welcome to Sunday. Um, I gotta be honest with you, I kind of forgot to record anything with the vlog today because nothing really happened. I mean, I, I went out, nothing special. I came back and just was either, I either took a nap or I did nothing and just laid down and relaxed all most of the day. It was, normal theme for me on Sunday, just relaxing and uploading a video. I didn't, uh, I did record any vlogs or do anything. I didn't even open my game of, uh, uh Smash Brothers 3D. It's still sealed in the packaging, so I have yet to play it. I mean, I've just been so pre- I mean, I've been focusing on trying to relax. I mean, I've been having a bunch of, I don't know, just issues with not relaxing because relaxing is hard for me to do, so... I don't know, I improved my setup a little bit, but that's it. I was doing also a bunch of research on soundproofing material, and that this stuff here that I have, is you can actually hear it now, that the uh, sound dies down a bit when I'm closer to it than it would be if I'm out over here. You can hear that it's a little bit, you know, whatever. 
Um, I probably need to do some more research into this stuff, but this is going to work. It's working okay for now. It, it just sounds a little better, but I don't know. I guess I'm going to have to do some testing. Um, that, that, that's all I've got for today. I haven't done anything except for, you know, the work on my computer and relax and take it easy. So I guess it's going to take it easy today, but uh, that's it. So I'm going to end things off for tonight here. Uh, yeah, ending things off for tonight here. So let's be back same time, same place tomorrow, shall we? Well, hello everyone. Welcome to what's today? Monday. Welcome to Monday. For some reason, I thought today was Tuesday. I don't know why. Uh, it's the end of the day. It's actually tomorrow, technically, because it's you know midnight. But I've been doing nothing today but just playing the game <clears throat> and getting it ready for you know to be viewed. I mean, I spent most of my time on it, and so I was just it's just been consuming most all of my time, which has just been a big thing and. I don't know, I'm still trying to see if I'm going to get vlogs up or not. I don't know, I just don't know if I'm going to be doing stuff like that. I Today my scheduling was kind of crazy. And um, something weird that happened today though is that we're going, me, Jeff, and Austin are going to try something different for, you know, our dinners. Because it used to be that we would just go out and get a uh, group, we would group our pool of money together and just get, you know, things as a group. Now, this week we're going to be... Um, doing stuff individually which to me it's I mean I don't care I can afford it it's just you know it's for it's for basically a long run scenario where it's cheaper in the long run to do it that way you know pooling your money together than it is for you to just go individually and go out and buy your own stuff so I don't know I don't know I know that I'm tired I need to get some rest because uh, I got work tomorrow but uh, I, I've kind of, since I'm so far ahead in the game right now, as far as recordings go, I think tomorrow I might probably try to start focusing on uh, the vlog a bit, if not some other project vlog-based, I guess. So, anyways, I'm going to be making an incredibly short vlog for today because I am just I need to go to bed. It's, it's late. I kind of lost track of time after I started hitting record on my, you know, on my computer because I was started recording at 6, and I mean, I've just been doing nothing but recording and editing and splicing files and making everything sound right and you know, annotations, uploading, all that stuff takes a lot of time. And it's midnight right now, so it's like okay, taking a time to go to sleep, I guess. So I gotta do that so that way I'm good for tomorrow. So let's meet back same time, same place tomorrow, shall we? And tomorrow should actually be I should get a package tomorrow from Amazon because. Last time I pulled this out, it was a while ago, it was this broken iPhone 5 that I had. That's nothing but a paperweight now because it, it saw a nice wash in the washer. It was one of my friends. He gave it to me for free because it's nothing. He can't really fix it. I can't fix it. So this product that I ordered, 17 bucks, claims that it can kill, destroy all the minerals or whatever that are lodged in there that's causing it not to work. I don't know. We'll see. You know, if it's not, there's a reason why I bought it on Amazon Prime, so that way I can return it and say this didn't work for nothing. So, and I even have, I'll record it and say this is my proof. So, anyways, tomorrow. Hello everyone, welcome to today's Tuesday. Tuesday, welcome to Tuesday. Um, I am, I'm at my desk a lot lately. I mean, I've just been doing nothing but desk vlogs, I guess. I mean, I'm just, because I'm just, there's no reason to go in the living room right now. I mean, I just want to get kept caught up on some work. So what I'm doing is I'm actually eating dinner today here at my desk, which is uh, steamed dumplings, like last time here. They're actually really good, and some regular tea. So, anyways, that, that's just update for now. But I actually did get something in the mail, which I will go through later. I just want to eat something first, and then I'll go through all my mail. Well, I actually kind of lied a little bit, because I, uh, Took a small nap after I ate, and I got up at around 8 o'clock, and now it's 9.14, which I know is bad. It's just uh, work and stress and stress and more stress. But anyways, here's a package I promised uh, that I would open up. It's something from Amazon, because I'm pretty sure I think I know what it is, but let's find out. Yep, the wet cell phone. Wet cellular phone emergency kit completely dries any mobile phone, including smartphones. 48-hour dry time, one-time use only. That—that's what it claims. Okay, 
and basically place wet item in bag and zip close directions do uh, use for only blah 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 100% success rate when directions are followed correctly. Directions do not use, uh, do not press buttons, remove battery, any phone immediately. Your iPhone uses only turn off the phone immediately. Uh, phone wet by salt water, rinse phone with distilled water, open bag, and tear line. Okay, so, hmm, toe, place within, okay. So basically, you have to take the phone out of whatever it was wet in, anything is what it's saying. And you just put it in, right? Directions for use. Do not press any buttons. Phone wet by salt water, soda, beer, rinse phone with distilled water. So i got to rinse the phone with distilled water, I guess. Open a bag and, at the tear line. Uh, towel dry phone. Place phone in bag. Screen facing up and zip bag close. Wait 48 hours. After dry time, open bag. If moisture remains, repeat step six. Once dry, remove the item from bag and replace battery. What if it's an iPhone? <laughs> Uh, turn on item dispose of bag questions dry all.com okay so I guess I'm gonna try this out and see what happens like I said I have I saw a bunch of things that's claimed that yeah this thing really works blah 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 but like I said I have somewhere around here uh, an old iPhone 5 that was, right here, that was given to me and I want to try it out because like it's supposedly it, it it's weird like it does work but it doesn't it's like you can hold down the, the home button and get siri to work but you can't see anything on the screen you can, you can feel the vibration rocker working it's just really weird how it works i guess i'm just gonna have to distill this thing and put it in distilled water and then pat dry it and then put it in that bag so i guess we're gonna see what happens with that